Hello my dear students, welcome to Baiju's exam prep. Hope you guys are fine. So guys, a very important notification for you all. National Highway Authority of India, NHAI has invited the application for the post of Deputy Manager Technical for Civil Engineering Branch. So what are the things, what is the grade pay, each and everything, what is the eligibility criteria Everything will be discussing quickly. So why to wait? Let's start. First of all, if you talk it about here, the level 10 of pay matrix 7th service pay commission, that is the basic pay band will be from 15,600 to 39,100 and the grade pay will be 5,400 rupees. Apart from that, if I talk it about, this is a direct recruitment for those candidates who have appeared in the personality test. That means who have gone till the interview round of the engineering services examination 2023 guys. So those candidates who have appeared, cleared the written, went to the mayor, went to the interview round, they are applicable, they are applicable for the notification which is being released by the National Highway Authority of India. Talking about the number of post bifurcation, here deputy manager, you have 31 posts for unreserved categories, 9 posts for ST category, 5 posts for ST, OBC 11 and EWS categories, you have 4 posts. Total, it accounts for 60 posts. Apart from it, if we talk it about the age limit is very, very important, guys. The age limit should not exceed to 30 years and you should have a mandatory degree in civil engineering from the recognized university institute. Talking about this is a direct recruitment, as I told you, on the basis of final merit of the written test and personality test, which you had given for ESC 2023, that is Engineering Services Examination 2023. As I told you, minimum qualification, if you talk it about, you should have completed the BTEC degree from or BE degree from a recognized in, uh, institute and your age limit should not exceed 30 years. Apart from it, here, if you have a reservation, that age relaxation is there, which has been mentioned to you here. Apart from that, if I talk it about uh, those candidates who have cast uh, category reservation, you have to submit all your cast categories proofs as and when uh, have been informed in the notifications. Talking next, as I told you, selection directly final merit list of written test and personality test. Service bond guidelines, this is very important. If you talk it about at the time of joining, you have to sign a bond of rupees 5 lakhs that you will be serving NHEI for a minimum of 3 years the moment you join the NHEI. In the case, if you are not able to fulfill, then you have to pay the bound, bond amount of 5 lakh rupees. Okay. Apart from this, if you will ask me that ma'am, how to apply, then you can apply through only offline mode. There is no online mode. There is no offline mode for here. If you talk it about here, the site is H. TTP www.nhai.gov.in. You can go through the site. You have to fill the forms, photographs, documents, certificates, interview call letter of the UPSC. Everything you will just upload it, and then then make sure that the last date may be submitted by 15th of February 6 p.m. So guys, this is the last date. So make sure that you submit it before this date. And apart from that, all other basic instructions size of the photograph has been mentioned you guys can go through it i'll attach the pdf in the comment section okay so guys if you have cleared the upsc written and you have uh, basically mains examinations and you have reached to the interview but you cannot make it to the final so nhei has given you one more opportunity so that you can get a direct recruitment and that too for the 10th pay matrix 15,600 to 39,100. So that's all for today guys and for more updates do subscribe to Baidu's exam prep. Thank you.